And we said, okay, so this gets predictably better as we increase compute, memory, data, whatever. And we can, we can decide, we can use those predictions to make decisions about how to scale this up and do it and get great results. And that has worked over, yeah, a crazy number of orders of magnitude. And it was so not obvious at the time. Like that was, that was I think the, the reason the world was so surprised is that that seemed like such an unlikely finding. Another one was that we could use these language models with reinforcement learning where we're saying, this is good, this is bad, to teach it how to reason. Mm -hmm. And this led to the 01 and 03 and now the GPT-5 progress. And that, that was another thing that felt like, uh, if it works, it's really great, but like, no way this is going to work. It's too simple. And now we're on to new things. We've figured out how to make much better video models. We are, we are discovering new ways to use new kinds of data and environment to kind of scale that up as well. Um, and I think, again, 20, you know, five, 10 years out, that's too hard to say in this field. But the next couple of years, we have very smooth, very strong scaling in front of us.